Mr. Mr. Mike, Larry O'Brien, it's his sight. Hit that subscribe bell. Don't forget to like it. Detroit Piston, Piston Mike. You know what time it is. You here for the update? Piston Mike, keep you informed. Make sure your substrate. So you don't ever go without the info that you need. Let's see the Pistons rise. To Detroit the top. Basketball. What's good, everybody? It's your boy, Piston Mike. Make sure you like, share, comment, subscribe. Don't cost anything, not even a nickel or dime. Come on, man. Stop playing with me, man. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button, man. Come on. Um, We're going to talk about top two players the Pistons should target if they're trading the pick away. Number one is Brandon Ingram. Why Brandon Ingram, Piston not? Why not? Now, the thing about Brandon Mingram is he's got a 15% trade kicker in his contract. Next year will be the last year of his contract. He's making $36 million. But for what the player type of player he bring um, and where the pick is, I think you can get him. I think you can get him. It's going to take more than the pick to get him. But they've been known to like Isaiah Stewart. You can throw in Isaiah Stewart. And you're probably going to have to throw in one of the core four to get him. And, you know, a pick or two. And you probably could get Brandon Mingram. Okay. He's scored 20 points a game. He shoots 49% uh, from the field. 35% from three. What more else do you need? Tall, lanky, modern day wing. You know, is he the best defender in the world? But no. But is he a decent defender? Yes. The type of player that you can put around Cade and you can build around this team and be okay. I don't know what he's looking for for his next contract, but I'm pretty sure it ain't going to be no less than 25 to $30 million. It ain't going to be no less than around that ballpark. And for worth that, I'll take him all day. I'll take him all day. I don't, I, over 35 to $40 million a year from him? I don't know. That, that, that's a little too, that's a little too crazy for me. Um, especially for the production, but I want to talk about his teammate real quick. Zion Williamson don't want no parts from him. Just because if he come here, I think, um, these Detroit girls, one of them would be breaking him, taking them for all this money. It would be sad, man. Don't need him in Detroit uh, around all that good food. Absolutely not. Mm -mm. He couldn't stay away from the Coney's to save his life. No. No Zion Williamson, man. Don't I don't want to touch him with a 10-foot pole. He don't play. He, don't, he barely even on the court. No. And it's just simple as that. But number two is no, uh, no other than... Mikael Bridges. Why you say Mikael Bridges? Because, well, number one, he was, um, he 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 his coach. He did play for Monty Williams for the Finnish Suns. Number two, he is another tall, lanky wing. Averages twenty points. Can shoot the three ball. Very efficient. But unlike Brandon Ingram, he's also a really really good defender. You know, so that's another thing. Um, so you want somebody who is a decent defender. We don't need you to be the greatest defender because we got dirt. Uh, I mean, because, you know, our team likes defense. So do I like, um, I like both of these two. I don't think you're going to be able to get Lori Market. I just don't. I don't think Danny Ames like to finesse people, so I don't think you're going to be able to get Lori Market in. Other guys, you might be able to get DeAndre Hunter if you fall to the fifth pick. That that would probably who you could get for the fifth pick. Unless you want Jeremy Grant again. I'm cool on the whole Jeremy Grant. Don't want him at all. <clears throat> Way too much money. Way too much money for Jeremy Grant. Don't don't want him back here again. Um, him and Cade didn't really. Um, I don't think they really mesh well. But um, DeAndre Hunter would be another really good one. But besides that, I don't really think anybody else is gonna be 
become available who you can really, you know, necessarily get. And I'm starting to think one of four court might be might be traded this off season, you know. Might be traded this off season. So um you guys let me know who should the Pistons go after? Should it be Brandon Mingram? Or should it be Mikael Bridges? Or you think if we or you think we should, you know, sign um sign Miles Bridges to a contract? Um, or you think we should go out there and go trade for DeAndre Hunter? Um, go trade for try to trade for Laurie Market and try to trade for Jeremy Grant again, even though I don't want him, you know, stuff like that. So it's it's gonna be a very interesting off season and Troy Weaver has the most pressure in this off season than he ever has before, you know. So you guys let me know how you feel about it, what you think about it, what you think about the video. But it's your boy Piston Mike. Make sure you like, share, comment, subscribe. Don't cost you anything, not even nickel or dime. Shout out to Alex for always keeping me updated. Click the link in the description for your cool pissing gear. Um, you guys let me know how you feel about this video. I'm out, man. Peace. Let's go. Detroit Ballin', it's part of the culture. It's a deep base, the trade you in a poster. You know the facts, so while we test the roaster. Killing your haze, deadly handles our exposure. True composure, team stack to win the chip. Act like I ain't told you. First round tick, had him sick. K Cunningham, pass John to Duncan, man. I don't know about y'all, but we come to I'm a Roger Grant, they all jumpin' in. Pissed in mic, we take your flight. Click like and subscribe, we can keep you right. Yeah, it's pissed in mic.